What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the NO1800 Let's Play Expert Campaign Mode. Um, so I wanted to start by saying we do have a lot of needs to fulfill here, and the engineers are not looking too good. The investors aren't either. I think the, the coffee, we're having a huge issue with that. We're having an issue with light bulbs, glasses, chocolate. Um, we don't even have any production for steam carriages quite yet. But uh, yeah, light bulbs are suffering. And I don't see that any of my production buildings here are actually out of resources. It's just that the demand for light bulbs is so huge. So let's take a look at, uh, I don't want to do any propaganda for now. Actually, I don't want to increase needs. So maybe we'll just put like a little tiny 5%er here and then just uh, publish that. So even that 5% kind of brought my income up a bit. But what I want to do is take a look at my demands here, statistics, and then take a look at what we're producing. So we're producing six light bulbs and three spectacles here. And what I need to do is take a look at Pella. Let's, or sorry, Bright Sands. Let's take a look at Bright Sands and then see what we're producing or what we're demanding. So we're demanding five. So actually, I should be fine on, on spectacles. Actually, no, I wasn't looking at spectacles. I was looking at light bulbs. So light bulbs are actually six. So I do need to outpace production a bit and uh, to, just to have a surplus because as of right now, I'm just sending over exactly what I need. Um, but of course, as I upgrade in, uh, engineers to investors, you know, obviously the needs will increase. But uh, so to solve the spectacle issue, I have a full spectacles here at Kefalenia, and I do have a bit of space, uh, also an oil power plant. So I think I'm doing like pretty good here. Uh, what I did is I made more canneries um, to also supplement the canned goods because I think I think the canned goods I am bringing over to. I thought I was bringing those canned food. Yeah, yeah. So I'm bringing canned food and beer over to over to uh, Bright Sands just from Kefalenia. So what I can do is get the spectacle factories over here down by the power plant so that they can actually uh, have increased production, but also create a trade route going down to Bright Sands from here. So let's move these spectacle factories. I want to put them there. And since I'm full here, I think I think I want to increase the storage as well, just so I make an absolute ton of spectacles. And I can probably the brass smeltery. Okay, might as well put these over here as well because increasing the output of the uh, of the brass will actually help. Because if if you increase the productivity of the spectacles, it's going to increase the demand on everything else. So um, putting that over there will really help. Let's see, window makers. Okay, we do have glass makers here. Maybe it would be smart to put the glass makers there as well. Um, yeah, let's put the glass makers over here with the electricity. How about we put them, we'll put it right. We can put it there. Just putting them next to each other. I'll put a firehouse there as well. But I just wanna make sure the spectacle production is secure here so I can really start trading a ton of it over to uh, Bright Sands. So I want to go ahead and make a little bit of road here. Make it look like an actual industrial area. So I'll wrap this road here, put that across. Okay, then maybe I'll put a warehouse actually right here. I think that would be a solid, solid thing to do. Wrap it around and then um, upgrade the warehouse. And then I think we could put some more storage here by maybe upgrading the docklands. I think that would be a smart, another smart thing to do. So let's put some depots in. Maybe I can rotate them. Yeah. Rotate them there, there. And I'm capped out on steel beams anyway. So um, that added quite a bit of storage and actually I can put a little road here too. So I probably should have upgraded Kefalenia off camera but I just wanted you guys to see kind of what I'm up to. Um, I didn't want to abandon Kefalenia at all, by any means. Um, so I want to bring in copper. Um, I'm bringing in zinc as well for steel. Um, or sorry, zinc and copper for the bronze. And then the glass I am bringing in. Um, let's see here. I, need, I do need to bring in quartz, but I think I'm bringing in a lot of that already. I think that's going to be here. Nope, that's just my shipyard. But uh, I do have a lot of quartz here. Yeah, from these sand mines. 
So I want to actually see what the demand on, or what the production is of these. So it'll be raw materials, um, quartz sand. So the demand on quartz sand is pretty heavy. So if I go to my dock lands and then try to compensate that a little bit, Captain Tobias is actually about to arrive here. So let's go to export import. Um, I don't think we need too much more iron or pigs really. Um, so I don't need to bring, I don't need two coal either. So let's trade maybe the fish for, um, can I, can I bring in the quartz sand? I should be able to trade it. Yeah, right here, right here. So we'll trade, um, 350, um, for quartz sand. And then we should be just completely good to go on, uh, on that. So my production of, uh, spectacles is going up and I want to find a spare, uh, cargo ship here. If I've got one, I don't, I don't see one here. Okay. Well, that's fine. Let's go ahead and buy one maybe from Archie. Archie doesn't have one. Okay. I wish there was like a pirate version of the cargo ship. That'd be really cool. So nothing there. Um, I don't, I just don't see any trade ships here. So I'm going to have to make one. Um, let's make one here at Pella and then we'll get our, uh, we'll get, we'll get the, um, spectacles coming in. Cause as you can see, they are an issue. Um, fur coats are an issue as well, but the coffee, why is the, why is the coffee such a problem? I don't understand that. We should probably increase the output of light bulbs as well. Cause we, we should, I think we have, let me see. Um, we have three light bulb factories as it is. Um, and, and it seems like they can't even keep up. So maybe we should um, improve by electricity. So so let's check the demand on filament and glass here and see what's going on. And see if we need to compensate with uh, with any more exports or, um, let's see, consumer goods, constru construction material. Um, raw material. So, so yeah, we're bringing in a lot of quartz sand, obviously. Um, intermediate products of glass. Okay. So demand on glass is actually pretty heavy right now. Um, so glass and then filament as well. So looks like the filaments are right at par. If we build another filament factory, actually. So coal is actually re a huge, uh, a huge demand. So let's check um, Captain Tobias and see how much coal we're bringing in. Um, yeah, let's let's increase this to nine hundred. And then, okay, so that'll be 2,800. Captain Tobias will be here in four minutes. So it won't stall the production by too much. So the coal for the filaments is coming in. Do I have, oh, quartz sand is coming in as well. Perfect. Um, let's go 350. Actually, 400. 400 schnapps for that. Um, 500 there. We'll do maybe 450 here. Um... Okay, so my schnapps isn't really that big of an issue. Storage full, okay. So I think we're doing okay with that. Um, so we do need to make another filament factory. I'll put one, how about we put it, uh, so the electricity comes all the way out here. My industrial area is getting a little full. Put the filament factory there. So that way the production of filaments, it's an intermediate good. So, okay, we're at eight filaments. And then the glass, I should probably make another glass factory as well. We'll put it there. And then we'll put um, another light bulb factory here. And how about there? I just want to make sure I have enough, you know. Um, okay, so how about, uh, how about, okay. So that'll be fine. The light bulbs will, light bulbs will start coming in a lot better. Um, let's check the trade route just to make sure. We're grabbing as much as we can. So yeah, we're grabbing a hundred here and we're just, we're just grabbing as many as we can. So, um, I think that'll be fine. So, um, now the investors, they need, um, okay. I need to check on the coffee. Um, but I also have a trade ship being made for the spectacles. Okay. Let's check on the coffee. Um, so this guy, the halibut should be picking it up. He's picking it up at Naxos. Perfect. So how much, Hopefully we have a lot of coffee here at Nexos. Um, yeah, it's decre it's increasing greatly, so that's good. Um, I think that maybe we don't have enough, um, I don't know, the coffee roaster. Maybe I can put another coffee roaster in. 
Okay, so we have five of coffee roasters? My goodness. And the, and the demand is still absolutely crazy. Like, we just grabbed... So this ship... What did this cargo ship just grab? It grabbed uh, 300. Oh, and we have a cargo ship here, too. So I think I can use this one, actually, to go ahead and grab more coffee when the time comes. Um, let's go to... Isabel Sarmiento. See, oh, she does have an extra cargo ship. I should just buy that. There we go. All right, so buying that. Um, so we will be bringing the coffee, and I just created that coffee route, that extra one. Um, so we should have quite a bit extra coming in there. And then the chocolate. So, okay, so the chocolate. I was thinking about that earlier. Um, let's see. The chocolate. So we do, we do have quite a bit of uh, sugar coming in. Um, and that's because because I'm buying it, but also I haven't created a trade route yet. But if you see all these fried plantain kitchens that I have, um, the more the more plantains they make, uh, the more sugar they make due to uh, the pro this legendary here, Gennaro Garibaldi. Um, so they every every four cycles they have a chance to make they they make extra sugar. So chocolate here. Uh, let's get this chocolate roll. No, I really want to finish this up. Okay, so we we need cocoa, but I think I do have a do I have a cocoa already? Yeah, it's increasing by plus four. Um, and it's I'm actually okay. So what's going on here? Am I actually making chocolate? Oh, I do have one, and it's right here. Nice. Okay. Um, so where is the f the fuel depot? The fuel depot should be. I don't know where the fuel depot is. Oh, it's right there. Um, so, maybe if I snake the railway a little more like this, I can maybe fit a cocoa farm here. I'm not sure. But, it does go all the way up here. So maybe, okay, let's let's build a bridge from here to there. Oh, construction material missing. Am I missing, um, what am I missing? Okay, let's just build a wooden bridge, that'll be good. Um, but I'm missing bricks. So maybe, maybe I should grab some bricks from here. No. Should I grab them from here? Yeah, this place has a lot of bricks actually. Or this has more. So how about I do this? Um, where is, okay, so the Rangoon here. Let's, let's get this one over to Ithaca. So once it gets to Ithaca, we'll grab some more bricks. But I do want to make a, make this bridge here. Um, so let's just, for now, let's just make it a road. So the fuel depot can actually reach all the way through here. Um, so maybe, maybe I can put a, maybe I can put one right here as well. I don't know. So I have, okay. So if I build, put oil here, I don't know. I know it's kind of tough because then I'd have to connect these, these rails here. Unless I brought them through here. And connected it. I have to delete this warehouse or just move it. But yeah, so chocolate is coming in here. I mean, it's not like it's not working at all. Um, so let's put at least one chocolate. Oh, that takes a hundred obreros. That takes so many. Okay. Um, so we're gonna need another population area, obviously. So I guess we'll put it kind of here. We tried putting one here. Um, okay. So their happiness, um, is affected by the church. Okay. Coins, um. How about we put some maybe here? Maybe we can fit some there so the farmland can go here or I, I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm a little confused on what I should do, but we'll start by putting them here. Let's blueprint, um. Yeah, I just need to make some more population here so I can support. So I can actually support the chocolate factories that I need to make. Because um, right now I have so much production of things as it is. Let's move down. Put one right there. Okay. Put the roads there, there, and we'll... Okay, I guess that's... I guess that works. I just want to pack these in as much as I can. I'm not really worried about how good it looks, if I'm honest. Um, I just want it to be 
I just want to squeeze some extra population in here. That's all I'm really concerned about. Um, so we'll put them there. And boom. Okay. So let's pick up some bricks here. Um, doo -doo -doo. All right. Bring it over to Naxos and deposit it there. And I do have a cargo ship just sitting there, so that'll be actually handy to have. And am I making um, alpacas? Am I making the ponchos here? Yeah, I am. But I should probably be trading them as well. Yeah, because I do have a lot here. So that that ship that's bringing these back and forth um, should also probably be loading ponchos. Let's see, where is it? Ah, here. There, because I don't want to run out of them too. Um, okay, so that ship is heading up there. All right, so we're on our way to making chocolate. That's what I. That's the ultimate goal here. Um, let's put a maybe just put a chapel there, and then that'll help bring up the happiness of them a bit. Maybe a fire station as well. That'll help to prevent prevent me losing population due to fires. Um, and then these guys, I think I think they're just unhappy. Be like my population's not happy because of the obreras. Um, they don't really have a whole lot to be happy about here, I guess. That, that sounds bad, but um, let's, let's put a hold on the cigars. I don't want them consuming this stuff. Um, I don't want them consuming coffee either, because that stuff needs to go straight to Bright Sands. Um, actually, they get... I get population out of that, so I actually just keep that. <laughs> um, so let them consume coffee again. But... Okay, so they don't get population out of that. Um, okay, but maybe if I put like a uh, like a fighting a boxing ring here, maybe I can get get some more happiness out of them. I'm not sure. We'll see. But uh, so the coffee came in. Um, oh yes, and I need to need to make sure the spectacles are also being traded back in the old world. Um, but the Obre I have an obrero shortage. Why is that? I think it's just because it's just because of the coffee not being um, not being delivered how I need it to. Um, okay, so these guys they have their they have all their needs fulfilled, so they will be ready to go pretty soon. Um, I'll just put some here. I know their needs will go up, and I'll probably need more ponchos. But what's going on here? This cargo ship is being attacked by what? Oh, by. Alonzo, of course. When is Alonzo not attacking me? All right, let's go back to the old world and then let's use this. Um, where did it go? Oh, it's not even done yet. Let's fast forward that and get it done. I thought the cargo ship would be done by now, but you know, of course it's not. It's slow as all hell. All right, there we go. Put on regular speed. Um, this one is the ocean spoon. Okay. Let's create a route, um, trade route, ocean spoon, where you at? There you are, from here to here. And then we're gonna load in Kefalenia. Um, let's get lots and lots of spectacles. Let's just overflow the storage because that is gonna be the main thing. And should I bring anything else, I wonder, just to kind of support production of stuff? Um, and no, my fur coats aren't being made there. Um, what else? Maybe chocolate. I don't know why I have chocolate here. Maybe it's because, oh, because I had things being traded. Yeah. All right. So that one's going to go and um, actually let's go back to that route because let's move to cargo ship routes and then we'll put it. Um, let's get the route. Oh, that ship, so that ship is going to go by the rupture, um, Margaret Hunt's Island, so I hope that it doesn't get attacked. We'll see, though. Um, so we're missing goods here. Oh, we're missing filaments. Why am, am I not producing enough filaments? Intermediate goods, what do we have here? Filaments, oh, yes, of course. All right. How much coal do I have? I should have quite a bit of coal, yeah. All right. Um, let's make another filament factory, of course. 
We gotta make sure these light bulbs are really flying in as fast as I as fast as they can. Um, we'll put one there. And I think that I hope that'll do it. I really do. Um, so here, let's see what we're okay. We're looking good on coffee. I, I should probably just dropped it off. We will be good on spectacles and we will be good on light bulbs because I just made more. So um, now that our needs are looking a little bit better, I'm not going to build more investors as of right now. But what I am going to do, I'm going to send the skipjack here. Um, let's go to, I want to get to Crown Falls. So Sunken Treasures Expedition, let's assign a ship. We're going to send the, um, which, which, uh, the Greedy Gannet now. Do I have another one? Let's send the skipjack. Um, and what do I want to bring? Diplomacy. Diplomacy, hunting, and rations. Okay, so let's rat Heraklion here. No. Trading post. Um, how about the old world? Uh, we can do... Okay, how about Alexandria? Rations. Um, actually, I need, I need some more. I probably could use some more um, slots there. Let's just assign the uh, the skipjack to. I I don't. It's fine that the morale is a little bit lower. Um. No. Uh, let's see. Exchange ship. Let's see. Skipjack. Where are you at? Skipjack two. Okay. Um. Let's get some fish. Let's get some. What what gives us hunting? Ah. Seriously. How does clay help with hunting? I don't understand that. So diplomacy now because um, let's see diplomacy. Where are you at? There, beer. I don't have any beer in Kefalonia apparently. Um, let's see, crafting. Nope, nope, nope. Medicine, hunting. Gosh, where is the diplomacy? Is it just alcohol? Let's see if I have schnapps. Um, I should have schnapps. Nope, that's medicine. Okay, what about champagne? Ah, diplomacy. Perfect. Um, I want to just transfer 10 of it. Okay, we'll start the expedition. Offers me a delivery quest. Sure, what you got for me? Uh, 10 tons of copper and 10 tons of gold. That's easy. Where's it at? Oh, it's up at Kefalonia. Okay. All right. Well, now that I'm going to be on the expedition, let's see. So the Crown Falls, the Land Alliance, I do need to do that as well. Pirate Hunt, the Passage, I do need to do that um, too. But either way, so um, Bright Sands is looking good. Except the Spectacles. Oh, that trade route still needs to happen yet. Um, but the coffee is coming in pretty nicely. I do want to complete this quest too, um, with, uh, Captain, Captain Cook or whatever his name is. Let's see. Where is he at? The Deep Blue. Stirrings from the Deep. So I want to, I want to go ahead and do that quest as well. So. I guess I'll just bring my gunboat down there. No. Maybe we'll bring, let's bring the, the Pyphorian Monitor down there. Then we'll, we'll, we'll see what this guy has in store for us. So Alexandria, um, what did I need to do? I wanted to, I wanted to make some more beer on Kefalenia because it's just, it's not as, um, what's going on here? Oh, of course it's being, of course. Speed up and get out of here. Okay. All right, let's start the expedition, and he's just going to go there and, and start it. Okay. Um, so, what I wanted to do is, let's see here. I wanted to make some more beer. Wait, what? Why is that destroyed? I wanted to make some more beer on Kefalenia. But also, like, this is not... Um, wish I had electricity coming in here. Maybe we could put some beer right, like, in this area. But I will need some more. I'm gonna need some more hops and um, and grain coming in. So 
Okay, um, I have the coal coming in here. The canneries are right there. How about I move the steelworks here? All right, let's move that stuff right there. The power does reach up there, so that's good. We'll delete these. We'll move these next to each other there. Just trying to reorganize Kefalenia so that it's, um... You know, it's actually reasonable. It actually looks decent, and it's useful. Um, handle the horn cautiously. Okay. Captain Tobias shares the tale of his first encounter with Deep Blue. Okay, so we're doing something with Captain Tobias here. So, the reason I'm doing this quest is because... Um, I got it for reaching a legendary export level. And he's got this quest for me. Um, buys a share of your... Are you serious? How did you... How did you buy a share? Oh, it's really not that. Wow, fuck. Mm, sorry, I didn't mean... I didn't mean to... S <laughs> I didn't mean to swear right there. Um, Because I don't know how YouTube uh, handles it and I want it to be friendly. But um, anyways, so... I want to do this quest because I want to see what the result is, like kind of what we what we require um, from them. So, what I see here is we need to handle this horn. Equip the foghorn in the Docklands main wharf. Okay. So the Docklands main wharf. Where is the items? Okay, the harbor master. So what we'll do is we'll put this horn in there. And then we'll equip it here. Okay, there it is. Alright, so we got the Foghorn. Okay. He wonders if that's gonna happen. Okay. Um... I don't see any sort of... anything coming yet. Unless there's like, uh, something... Tobias urges you to take a picture of the shark, deep blue. Oh, there... okay, so there's a shark. Okay. Um, take a photo. So we're taking a picture of a shark. A shark named Deep Blue, apparently. Okay, I guess that's just as good as any. Um, we'll submit it. Okay, Gantrin shark spotted. Eyewitnesses describe the beast as a larger than any I've ever seen, and a monster... A monster of a thing. Okay. <laughs> that's goofy. <laughs> so I submitted that picture, and now what? Urges you to escort Deep Blue to safety. Okay. Let's escort. It's considered a ship. Let's escort the ship. There we go. So I wonder if I'm actually going to be attacked by anything. Um, I don't know if I will. She's the last of her kind. Yep. So I want to send that ship to go ahead and try to uh, try to help out. As long as I don't get hit by this. Oh, yep, yep. There we go. Getting hit by Alonzo Graves' harbor here. That's alright. Alright, so one of my ships is under attack. Yes, I know. Um, let's see, the expedition to Sunken Treasures. It looks like it's doing good. Doing really good. It picked up the goods, and alright, we're escorting Deep Blue there. Alright, let's take a look at the engineers again. So the engineers are looking really good. I can upgrade some more stuff. I just have an issue with steel beams, of course, but when do I not? Um, so I wanted to get some beer, get the beer going here a little bit better than it is. So maybe we can do this. How about we, um... Still have access to power there. That's good. So I want to take advantage of all the oil that's being made here. Put, uh, how far down does power go? Oh, quite a ways, apparently. Yeah, quite a ways. Sounds good. Let's go ahead and move the breweries here. Then, of course, I can put a, uh... Expedition is underway. Yep, I know because I told it to I told the expedition to happen. So um, let's move this one here. Maybe I can just yeah, let's put them there um, The malt houses will go here Maybe I should make it one more malt house. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. We'll we'll see we'll see how that uh, how that improves over time, but let's move the Move the warehouse maybe here Put the 
barrier around it. And then maybe, yeah, maybe we could do another malt house here. Um, let's we'll put the road kind of going this way. Okay. All right. Um, so the power is is working on all of those. Then we'll put we'll put and maybe should I put another fire station? I don't I don't know if I really should, but I guess I can put one here. And honestly, maybe I can put a fuel station over here as well. Um, but yeah, so I'm missing grain. But yeah, I could put... So I could bring an oil route here and then put a fuel station here so that the grain comes in a lot faster. Um, and I think that would be probably a really good thing. Um, but let's put a put my window factories, my window makers here. There we go. And how about we put... Um, so I don't need these, obviously. It would be a shame for my warehouse. Let's put my warehouse, like, let's delete this one. Put this one here, because it's a medium one. Oh, what's going on? Oh, it's just uh, Alonzo again attacking me. Um, so this is going well. Um, window makers, let's put the other one. Maybe I don't need this one. I don't need this third one because... Because I have two on electricity already. Oh wait, what did I just delete? Did I just delete a glass maker? Uh, maybe I did. I don't know what I deleted, but, um... Anyways, freed up all that space up there. Looking good. Um, let's get rid of all that, all that. So there, Kefalania is looking better. And I don't want, like, I think Kefalania will be... Probably, once I get, once I get access to Crown Falls... Oh! Why did it get destroyed? Oh, that's why. Um, okay, so that shark is actually going. That shark, okay. Um, let's get rid of this ship of the line here. Um, why does it have all these pigs? That's strange. Throw those overboard. Um, so... Escort Deep Blue to safety. So Deep Blue is actually cruising right through all these contested areas, and I, I'm not too happy about it. Because I just lost my warships because they were helping him. Um, so yeah, that's, that's not cool, but we are producing, looks like we're doing really good on beer now. Let's see how much we're making. So beer, we're making 12, my goodness. So the demand on hops is huge. Demand on grain is huge. So how about we put in a fuel station maybe? Um, so how much, how much am I storing here? The oil harbor, I actually have quite a lot. Let's upgrade the storage. Yeah, let's upgrade that storage. Um, so then that way I can move the grain over here and make them give them some more modules. What's going on here? Oh. So I think I'm st I should be still bringing in hops to Kefalenia from here. I think. Yeah, I'm bringing in a lot here, but I'm also trading a lot. So what's going on? Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Yep, so the hops are still coming in. That's really good. I'm glad they are. Um, but Kefalenia is looking a lot better now, so the beer is doing really, really well. The spectacles, let's see, the spectacles are doing really, really well too. Um, but yeah, so so I'm fixing up Kefalenia very slowly. What I want to do is make a bunch more investors here and um, kind of beautify this more. I want to add like a little theme park here. Just make it look really good. I'll, I'll probably do that off camera though, since you guys... Um, don't really need to see that, but this was more of an episode just to update you on what's going on. I haven't really played off camera, but but I do I do really want to just go ahead and get to the sunken treasures, go ahead and get um, Crown Falls going, and um, you know just solve. I think I've pretty much solved all my supply chain issues, but uh, Crown Falls once I get access to it, I think is just going to be a pure production, like a farmer slash production place, um, and that's that's about it. And I think I think I might just trade. I might just trade stuff here. I don't know, but it looks like uh, looks like my buddy Vincente here has a control on this eastern quadrant, besides here. But uh, I can adjust the trade route to bring things straight up here to Kefalenia, and that won't be a problem at all. So that's exciting. I can probably just bring everything to Rhodes. Um, yeah, so uh, it's looking good. It's looking good. Thanks for stopping by to watch my video, and I will catch you on the next one.